It's time to play Future City Feud. Now, here's your host, Matthew Burrows. Hello, I'm Matthew Burrows, and I'm your host on Future City Feud. Let's welcome our three contestants. I understand you all were on the team to help write the plan document, and you helped build the model. So tell us your names. Hi, I'm Sierra. Hi, I'm Mary. Hi, I'm Isabella. So I guess you three have a lot of knowledge about Future City Project man Management. Now I'm going to ask you a series of questions, and you can hold up your sign if you know the right answer. Each question will be worth either 50, 100, or 200 points. The person with the highest score at the end of the game will receive an all-expense-paid vacation to the beautiful Pearl City located in Manila Bay, Philippines. Ladies, are you ready? Yes. yes. These first four questions are each worth 50 points. Question number one, what is the budget limit for the model and presentation? Sierra. The total budget for the model and presentation combined is $100. Correct. Qu next question is number two. What are the deliverables for the Future City Project? Mary. The deliverables are the... SA Subsidy, which are both due in December, and the model and presentation, and the plan document, which are all due in January. Correct. Question number three. What helps the team stay on track? Isabel. Our calendar and our check-in documents help to keep the team members on track. Good answer, and that is correct. Question number four. When did your team work on the Future City Project? Isabel. My team worked on Future City three days a week. We met after school on Tuesdays and Wednesdays from 2.30 to 4.30, and we met every Saturday from 9 o'clock to 3 o'clock. Correct. Now on to the 100-point questions. Question number five. What is the total number of hours your team spent on the Future City project? Mary. Our team worked over 1,500 hours as a team on our project. Correct. Question number six. How did your team divide up the workload? Sierra. Our team divided into different teams. We had the essay team, the model team, the Sin City team, and the plan team. Everyone worked on their special part. Some people were on more than one team. Correct. Question number seven. What are the other documents that have to be submitted prior to the competition besides the deliverable? Isabel. We also have to submit our honor statement on media waivers and our expense report. That is right. Question number eight. How many teams can advance to the national to nationals from each region? Sierra. Only one team from each region can advance to nationals in Washington, D.C. Correct, Sierra. Now on to the 200-point questions. Question number nine. What is the name of the process that helped you create your entire city? Mary. The engineering design process helped us create our beautiful Pearl City. Absolutely right. Question number ten. What are the steps in the engineering design process? Isabella. The engineering design process starts with identifying the problem, then brainstorming solutions, designing a solution, testing it, redesigning it, testing it again, and finally implementing it, and sharing the idea with others. Brilliant. Question number 11. What safeguards did you have in place to make sure your SimCity was finished and delivered on time? Sierra. We started out with five SimCity teams in order to make sure that at least one of them would finish on time. A few of them either failed to finish their city or their city died from bankruptcy. So in the end, we had two finished SimCity presentations to choose from. Good job answering that question. Question number 12. What safeguards did you have in place to make sure nothing went wrong with the building of the model? Isabel. We would keep the model locked up. That is wrong. Mary. We had dads who would come and supervise our team while using power tools and wiring the model to make sure we did everything right and didn't get hurt. That is right. And now for the bonus question. This question is worth 300 points. How did you keep everyone on task and working instead of messing around? Isabel. We made sure everyone had a task to perform. Every time they came to a work day, we took breaks to make sure we weren't stressed. And we made sure the work days were fun. You're absolutely right. So now the score stands at Sierra 450, Mary 550, and our winner is Isabella at 700. Congratulations, Isabella. You have won an all-expense paid trip to the Pearl City where you and a friend will stay in our luxurious bamboo apartments, ride the amazing ferry, and hybrid.
explore our beautiful Central Park, catch a movie at a world famous Pearl City 7D theater, and even go scuba diving in the warm tropical waters of sparkling Manila Bay. Have a great trip, and thanks for playing Future City Feud.